Let's dive into the formidable arsenal of the Japan Ground Self-Defense Force, JGSDF, where the spotlight shines on the Type 12 anti-ship missile system, which is an absolute game-changer. Picture this, a truck-mounted coastal defense marvel that hurls supersonic missiles at enemy vessels, boasting a striking range of up to 200 kilometers. The Type 12 missile, with its sleek, stealthy design, packs a punch with a high-performance seeker and a warhead capable of piercing the hull of even the strongest ships. This cutting-edge system isn't just a lone warrior. It dances in harmony with a network of sensors and platforms like radars, drones, and helicopters, amplifying its precision and situational awareness. This system was first showcased in 2016 on the strategic Miyakojima Island, positioned near the disputed Senkaku Islands in the East China Sea. The JGSDF strategically sprinkled the Type 12 system across islands like Ishigaki and Amami Oshima in the Southwest Archipelago, sending a clear message, deterrence. The Type 12 system isn't just cutting edge, it's a statement of Japan's prowess in maritime security. With its deployment marking a milestone, this system is hailed as one of the most advanced and effective anti-ship missile systems globally, placing Japan firmly ahead in the race for maritime supremacy. Another remarkable weapon in the JGSDF inventory is the Type 03 surface-to-air missile system. This is a mobile air defense system that can shoot down incoming aircraft, helicopters, cruise missiles, and drones with infrared-guided missiles. The Type 03 system consists of a launcher vehicle, a fire control vehicle, and a radar vehicle. The launcher vehicle can carry up to eight missiles, which have a range of about 35 kilometers and a speed of Mach 3. The fire control vehicle can control up to six launcher vehicles, and the radar vehicle can detect and track targets up to 100 kilometers away. The Type 03 system can also be integrated with other air defense systems, such as the Patriot Pac-3, to form a layered and comprehensive defense network. The Type 03 system was introduced in 2010 and has been deployed in various locations locations across Japan, especially near major cities and bases. The Type 03 system is regarded as one of the most advanced and reliable surface-to-air missile systems in the world, and it provides Japan with a robust and flexible air defense capability. 4. Moving on to the JGSDF's armored vehicles, one of the most impressive examples is the Type 10 main battle tank. This is a fourth-generation tank that is designed to be highly maneuverable, adaptable, and survivable. The Type 10 tank has a 120mm smoothbore gun that can fire fire armor-piercing, high-explosive, and multi-purpose rounds. It also has a coaxial machine gun, a remote-controlled weapon station, and a smoke grenade launcher. The Type 10 tank has a modular armor system that can be adjusted according to the threat level and mission requirements. It also has an active protection system that can detect and counter incoming projectiles. The Type 10 tank has a diesel engine that can generate up to 1,200 horsepower and a hydro-pneumatic suspension that can adjust the height and tilt of the hull. The Type 10 tank can reach a speed of up to 70 km per hour on road and 50 km per hour off road. It can also cross rivers up to 4 meters deep with a snorkel kit. The Type 10 tank was developed in the 2000s and entered service in 2012. It is currently the main tank of the JGSDF, and it is considered one of the most modern and powerful tanks in the world. Another notable armored vehicle in the JGSDF fleet is the Type 16 Maneuver Combat Vehicle. This is a wheeled armored vehicle that is designed to provide rapid and mobile fire support for infantry and other units. The Type 16 vehicle has a 105mm rifled gun that can fire armor-piercing, high-explosive, and anti-tank guided missiles. It also has a 12.7mm machine gun, a 7.62mm machine gun, and a smoke grenade launcher. The Type 16 vehicle has a composite armor that can withstand small arms fire and shrapnel. It also has a fire control system that can automatically track and aim at targets. The Type 16 vehicle has a diesel engine that can produce up to 570 horsepower and a four-wheel drive system that can handle various terrains. The Type 16 vehicle can reach a speed of up to 100 kilometers per hour on road and 70 kilometers per hour off-road. 
It can also be transported by air, sea, or rail. The Type 16 vehicle was developed in the 2010s and entered service in 2016. It is currently the main fire support vehicle of the JGSDF, and it is considered one of the most versatile and agile armored vehicles in the world. Finally, let's take a look at some of the JGSDF's uniforms and equipment. The JGSDF has several types of camouflage patterns that are used for different environments and purposes. The most common one is the Type 2 camouflage, which is a four-color pattern that is suitable for woodland, urban, and desert areas. The Type 2 camouflage was introduced in 1991 and is currently used by the JGSDF, the Japan Maritime Self-Defense Force, the Japan National Defense Academy Cadets, and the Japan Air Self-Defense Force, Air Rescue wings, para-rescue men. The Type 2 camouflage has a 50% cotton, 50% nylon, or 70% nylon, 30% cotton fabric, depending on the manufacturer. Another type of camouflage is the Type 3 camouflage, a modified version of the Type 2 camouflage with some changes in the design and features. The Type 3 camouflage has a mandarin collar, velcro cuffs, and pocket lids, wider pen pockets, a loop inside the right chest pocket for an ID card chain, two calf storage pockets, and knee pads in the trousers. The Type 3 camouflage also has a belt with a name tag. The Type 3 camouflage was introduced in 2007 and is currently the main combat uniform of the JGSDF. The Type 3 camouflage has the same pattern and fabric as the Type 2 camouflage. A third type of camouflage is the JGSDF desert camouflage, which is a three-color pattern that is used for inter national peacekeeping operations in arid regions. The JGSDF Desert Camouflage was adopted in 1992 and is currently used by the JGSDF International Peace Cooperation Activities Training Unit and the JGSDF Central Readiness Force. The JGSDF Desert Camouflage has a 50% cotton, 50% polyester fabric. In addition to the camouflage uniforms, the JGSDF also uses various types of personal equipment and gear. Some of the most common items are the Type 88 helmet, which is a ballistic helmet that can protect the head from shrapnel and bullets. The Type 89 assault rifle, which is a 5.56 millimeter rifle that can fire semi-automatic, three-round burst, or full automatic modes. The Type 06 combat knife, which is a multi-purpose knife that can be used for combat, survival, or utility purposes. And the Type 07 backpack, which is a modular backpack that can carry up to 40 kilograms of equipment and supplies. The JGSDF also uses other items, such as body armor, night vision goggles, radios, binoculars, grenades, and bayonets, depending on the mission and situation. These are just some of the examples of Japan's advanced weaponry and equipment that the JGSDF uses. Japan has a long history of developing and using advanced weapons and equipment, dating back to the feudal era of the samurai. Today, Japan continues to pursue excellence and innovation in its military technology technology, while adhering to its pacifist constitution and its commitment to international peace and security. The JGSDF is one of the world's most professional and capable ground forces, and it is constantly improving and modernizing its arsenal to meet the challenges and threats of the 21st century. We hope you enjoyed this video and learned something new about Japan's advanced weaponry. If you did, please give us a like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more content like this.